Hi, I'm Lawrence Whitfield. It's been 25 years since Neil deGrasse Tyson coined the term Manhattan Hedge. So here is a GeoGebra to rent a GeoGebra rendition of the phenomenon in order to celebrate that milestone. This video will provide an explanation. My thanks to Paul McDowell for this picture of Manhattan Henge taken a few years ago. I will add a link in the comments below about Manhattan Henge in the event that you're not familiar with the term. First of all, every person on earth has, has a location. Here's the location of some intersection in Manhattan. Let's say it's 48.8 degrees north and 74 degrees west. And rather than longitude, we're going to use the term meridian. So to do so, we're going to look at the apparent path of the sun. That is the, the pathway that the sun traces out from sunrise to sunset. It's also known as the sun path or the day arc. Of course, the sun path depends upon the location of the observer, i.e. their latitude and meridian, and the particular day of the year. It's going to look something like this. So we'll look into it in more detail next time. This was just to make an introduction. Talk to you then.